Hey everybody, welcome to the Sim Hangar. My name is Mark. I've been lucky enough to get a tour of the Grand Canyon, or a bit of it anyway. Halfway through the tour, well, we got the opportunity to stop for some light refreshments. Check out the skills on this landing. Can you spot where we're going to land? Oh my goodness, this is epic. But that's not all. In this tour, we weren't just one helicopter. Well, actually there were six. And in no time, number two touched down. And within a few minutes, guess what? Yeah, all six helicopters, all H-130s were down. But we couldn't spend long. Time to head to Las Vegas. And as we went en route, we had the opportunity to pass over the Hoover Dam and we got some spectacular views. You'll notice that the water level's quite low. The pilot said 150 feet below where it should be at this time of year. When you see the dam up close like you do here, wow, you get an idea of just how big an engineering feat it is. But all we could afford was a quick flyby and it was time to head on to Las Vegas and to Harry Reid International, where we'll be landing. It's about 11 o'clock in the morning, and it's only a moderate 32 or 34 degrees Celsius. On board, in addition to the pilot, while well, there were six of us. The H-130 is surprisingly spacious, but in no time at all, well, we were over Las Vegas and heading towards the International Airport. There it is, and we did a quick approach. And once again, the pilot demonstrated amazing skills. Look at these piloting skills here. Well, they're a whole lot better than what I can do, that's for sure. Out of the six helicopters, well, we were number two down. Well, we're now in Las Vegas and we're getting ready for the Flight Sim Expo 2024, which starts tomorrow on Friday. My thanks to Maverick Helicopters for an epic tour. The Flight Sim Expo, well, it should be a really good one. We have nearly all of the big names in attendance. In addition to Microsoft Flight Simulator, of course, well, we've got the likes of Verpal, Thrustmaster, Fabian from FlightSim.com will be there demonstrating the Force Feedback Yoke, the CLS-60, as well as the CLS-120. Keen to give that a go. Also looking forward to having a chat to Doff Reality, the motion platform, to see what improvements they've brought. Many more in attendance, of course. We've got Somnium VR, Pimax, Say Intentions, and Beyond ATC and more. Stay tuned, and I'll be bringing you the updates and highlights when I can. Thanks very much for watching. Stay well, look after yourselves. Ciao for now.